For our renders in Maya, we will want to use multiple AOVs. However, ambient occlusion isn't in Maya by default, and we have to just set that one up. However, it shouldn't take long. So, in Maya, we need to go to the uh, render settings, which is this tab here, which opens all our settings for the renderer. We need to go to AOVs and click Add Custom. Now I'm just going to call this A Occlusion and Create. So that AOV is now ready to be set up. We're now going to the Hyper Shade. And then down here, we click and press Tab and we search for Ambient Occlusion. So the AI Ambient Occlusion is what we're going to use. So this is grabbing the ambient occlusion in the map, in the project, and now we just need to apply it to the AOV. So we're just going to rename it to occlusion underscore MTL. So Maya knows it's a material and press enter. And this is the important part. So now we need to click on the ambient occlusion AOV, and this is going to change our material attributes on the right here. We need to make sure we click this so then we're not changing the wrong thing. So make sure we click the AOV. And we're going to focus on the custom AOV shader. Now, under the hyper shade, we're going to middle mouse click, drag and drop the material into the shader. So middle mouse, click and hold to drag, and then let go to drop. We then click on it and press enter. And this will apply it to our render view. We can check this by going into Arnold and Render and then changing from Beauty to Ambient Occlusion. And as you can see, we've now got an Ambient Occlusion AOV on our model in Maya.